and welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the title of this video, today I've got a huge, huge spring and summer kind of themed Shein haul to share with you guys. I was in a shopping mood and I was on Shein and I don't know, I just ended up buying a lot of stuff and I can't wait to share it with you guys. I saw previously about a year ago, I did another haul like this, but I will include the link to that video in the description box below if you want to check it out. And the funny, funny thing about this is this video right here is the first video I'm filming since I chopped my hair off. I noticed that the last time I filmed, I think that was one of the first videos that I filmed after I chopped my hair off last year. I wasn't going to do it yet this year, but I was just getting tired of the long hair and the maintenance and I just was getting too lazy to do it all the time. But yeah, so I'm really excited to share all this stuff with you guys. I've kind of separated them out into piles because there's a lot of like rompers and dresses and like two piece sets that are like their own outfits and then there's a lot of tops and skirts. So. I have a lot, overwhelmingly, a lot more um, tops. So I think I'm gonna try those on first with these jeans that I'm wearing right now and just kinda work from there. But yeah, so I will include the prices for everything down here like I try to usually do. And yeah, links for anything that is still available out of these clothes will be in the description box below. So check that out if you guys are interested in anything I show you guys. But the first thing I wanna start with is this little wallet because this is the only non-clothing item that I I picked up I was gonna pick up some accessories but then I got too lazy because I picked up too many clothes but yeah this little lavender wallet was three bucks originally I got it for like 250 something because of a coupon that I had so this is what it looks like up close it's got the little tassel a little keychain and it opens up like this y'all know already why I picked this up right it's lavender See, like I, the idea of it in my head was like, ooh, it's so cute and lavender. I could probably use it for something other than a wallet. But I don't know if you guys can tell, but the material and the make of it is so, it's kind of cheap. So I don't know if I'm going to keep this, to be honest. I might just, I don't know, use it for something else. I don't trust this as a wallet just because I have a feeling this material right here, once I start using it more than a day it's gonna like fall apart so we'll see what I do with this but yeah that is the first little thing that I picked up so the first top that I've got on for you guys is this really cute sweetheart neckline like black long sleeve shirt I'm gonna come up close so you guys can see the detail I don't know if you guys can tell but it's got this cute puffed sleeve I love this so this is a size extra small so it is really skin tight like putting on the sleeves was very, very tight, but if you're looking for a fitted look, I was looking for a really fitted shirt so that I could wear it with a high-waisted skirt or something like that. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's really nice. What I appreciate about it is it has um, a zipper in the back, so it is really tight and fitted. I think this will look absolutely darling with a high-waisted skirt. I just, I love it. It's really, like, form-fitting and hugging the curves a little so I really like this one so we're off to a good start next up I've got this little crop top right here it's just a plain crop top with that baseball kind of style of a uh, design up here with the sleeves and stuff but um, with this haul I was looking for a lot of spring summer clothes but I was also looking for quite a few basics that I needed to add to my closet there's gonna be a bunch of like plain crop t-shirts and stuff like that because I just feel like I needed to update the ones that I had, like the white Forever 21 crop tops that I had. They were kind of leaning towards not being so white anymore. So, and then the black shirts are leaning towards being gray now. So I needed to update a lot of my basics. So this is one of them. I think this is really cute. It fits really nice. The material is pretty thick and feels pretty good for Shein. I thought it was going to be more sheer, to be honest, over here. And it's it's looking like it's giving me pretty good coverage so this is a great top to just throw on with high-waisted jeans like these or high-waisted shorts and I feel like I can wear this into the spring and summer sometimes when I'm wearing like a high-waisted short or a skirt I like to wear a long sleeve that's kind of thin on top to kind of even it out so I'm not showing too much skin you know wearing a tank top and showing my legs so I like having something showing but not everything showing you know what I mean so if I'm showing a lot of leg I ain't trying to show 
all of this up here sometimes you know but I really like this it feels great so this one is good too so two for two I guess for now this next top is a lot more spicy a lot more piratey but um this one actually looks similar to a shirt that I picked up in a previous Shein haul I think it was from like the fall ish time I will include the link to that in the description box below I'll include the links to all of my previous Shein hauls if you want to check them out because there's some really cute stuff on there so yeah this one is just like a girly roughly I don't know if you can tell it's so romantic it's got the puff sleeves it's got this corset kind of style up here so I don't I don't really know if you're supposed to tighten it but if it's pretty tight to begin with it is an extra small I love again it has a zipper to make sure it's fitted but this is a great great top you could wear it on a date night you could dress it up dress it down freaking love this this feels so luxurious and thick and the material feels so good you would have never thought it was from Shein yeah there are some things on that website that are kind of duds I've had them previously in hauls before but just like any other online website when you're shopping online you can't really try it on touch it and stuff you just gotta check the reviews and all that stuff and sometimes you just gotta take that leap and take that risk because sometimes it's worth it up next I've got this blouse right here it's sleeveless this is right up my alley I have a lot of blouses in this style and this kind of material but I gotta say like this is the best one I've ever felt like I was expecting that you know cliche chiffon material when it comes to these blouses but it's like a little thicker and softer and I don't know it just feels like cottony and nice it feels so expensive this is the detailing around the collar there's like little pearls and then this black string you can untie and retie you can leave it hanging if you want but um yeah this is really cute I of course got this so that I could tuck it into a high-waisted skirt I thought with a black skirt this little black detailing it would be so adorable but yeah this is really nice I got it in a size extra small so it fits really great and I don't know it just I can't stop touching the material it's so soft I definitely recommend this one because if you're into like that chiffon blouse kind of style this is like so amazing and it's not as see-through as I thought it would be I don't know if it really even is see-through is it I mean can you see my black bra maybe but um for these kind of shirts you know I'm used to them being completely see-through so this one's pretty good look at this neck do you guys see how small this neck is I am so confused but um I'm gonna try to force my head through like a baby coming out of the womb and I will get back you guys okay guys so I forced myself to get through this shirt and it's just like it's so weird because the sleeves and stuff fit a little loose but the neck is like made for like an infant I don't know it's so tight but like I can stretch it so it's it's fine it stretches around the head but it's just like why is it so tiny to begin with but um this is what it looks like as you guys can see it is pretty much completely see-through which is not a thumbs up for me I don't like it being see-through I mean I am gonna layer this with dresses most likely so maybe I can keep it thinking that I'm gonna cover up this boobage anyways but I don't know this one is probably gonna have to be returned but the um, sleeves and stuff it has a lettuce style hem and so does the bottom I think this is meant to be a crop top yeah cuz I'm wearing high-waisted jeans so yeah I mean it's cute if you're looking for something that's see-through to go out in and stuff at night, you know, but um, that's not what I was looking for, so I, yeah, I don't know, maybe. I might try this on with a dress over and see if it's fine, but it is, honestly, the material is ribbed, but it's a little itchy, so that's kind of a, hmm. Yeah, so I guess this was the first dud, but um, yeah, I need to get out of this. It's kind of itchy. So speaking of basics, here's one of the basic crop tees that I picked up for myself and of course it's in lavender y'all it's never a haul without some lavender in it from me so this is what I got right here it's v-necked it's got ruffle on the bottom of the sleeve it's got the little twist front right here it's there's a lot going on it's cropped so yeah I really like this I picked it up just so you know spring summertime I can just 
throw it on and run out of the house with some shorts on you know what I'm saying so I really like this it's kind of thin but it's fine like I knew what I was kind of getting into with this shirt I knew it wasn't gonna be luxurious per se but I really like it you know it's a great basic and it's gonna do the job so I picked up quite a few shirts that were similar to this one with the twist cropped thing in the front so yeah I picked it up in white black and nude yeah I don't have a problem I promise this is the crop t-shirt in nude and it, as you can tell right away, it's different from the lavender shirt. These next three shirts are from the same listing. That lavender one was from a different one. So these are more of a plain t-shirt that's cr t-shirt. Did I say t-shirt? These are like more of a plain t-shirt type with regular sleeves, you know, no v-neck, just a little crop and a little twist front in the front. So I really like this. This is exactly what I was looking for just to throw on. And it feels great. Like the material is pretty thick. I'm surprised it's not completely see-through to be honest for the price I paid this honestly is a win because you can just you can't go wrong with a plain t-shirt you just throw it on run out the door go kick a basketball kick a basketball I said kick it you know what it's morning guys the weather's starting to get warm I just don't know how to act <laughs> I'm saying kicking a basketball but you know what I mean you know kick around a soccer ball play basketball do whatever you can go shopping do grocery shopping just do whatever you want in this shirt you know I mean that's what you do in your clothes you do whatever you want but yeah so let me show you guys the other colors and hopefully they're the same quality as this one because they're from the same listing so they better be here is the t-shirt in black and I like it it's just like the nude feels great quality you know I really like it I want it I got it so I'm happy about it yeah it's great and then I could layer stuff with it too if I wanted to I just this is great this is a great staple piece for the closet you know so this one is the white one this is the one I was more worried about because you know white has the more of a tendency to be really see-through when you're buying from a more affordable place but um is it see-through I don't really think it is I'm standing directly in the Sun from my window and it looks like it's not really that see-through at all so I'm really happy about that I'm so happy that I picked up smalls and the fit is the way it is these kind of shirts I don't want them you know to be too skin tight because the point I bought them is so that they're comfy I can just throw them on and go grocery shopping or something like that so this next crop top is very very cropped it's like a basically a bralette kind of style of the crop top this feels really great I don't know if you can tell it's really thick the material it's not see-through it feels very expensive like it feels like I got it from somewhere really nice to be honest but um yeah I got it in extra small I think I could have sized up to a small because it is a little tight like here and so like you see a little bit of um you know that underarm spillage over you know what I mean but um it's really cute I got it so that I could wear it with something high-waisted I really like this it feels great I think honestly this might be my favorite piece this is gonna be such a stable piece in my wardrobe I already can tell so the next top is this one right here it's kind of similar to that other one but this one is off the shoulder it's this ribbed like velvety kind of soft material it's really nice this is another one I'm honestly surprised about the quality you know I buy a lot of stuff from Shein and you've seen from my hauls like I typically buy a lot of clothes but you know this is really good quality maybe they're improving their quality and stuff I don't know I like it it's cute I like the ruffles I like the material it's like a thick ribbed material it looks really cute really high quality you would have never known I got it from Shein but guess what I did the next two tops are another one of the ones that I picked up two of the same shirt in different colors so let's get these on so this is what the top looks like in the white color it is as you can see a long sleeve shirt it's got a ribbed kind of style material on here it's got a little ruffle on the shoulders and then also around the neck it's got a little button as well on the neck to make it tighter and I really like it it's really cute it's a little see-through as you can tell but I mean all you have to do is just not wear a dark colored bra this is the shirt in the lavender color and um, yes I love it it is 
actually pretty lavender. It's really cute. Like I said, with the white one, it's this thick material. It feels the same quality as the white one. Very good, very nice and thick, but not too thick that I'll be too hot. But I think that on like a cold spring summer night, this is really cute. I don't know, like where have all these things been hiding my entire life? Because these are all things like I've always imagined having in my closet. I could never find for the right price. Okay guys, so this is the next top. This one is a super high neck crop top. It has that same ribbed material, but this one's a little thinner. And um, there's no tag like in the back of this. So honestly, I couldn't tell which way is the front and which one's the back. It looks like they're cut the exact same. So there's not one side that's kind of shorter, but I don't know. This fits kind of weird. Do you see this like, gathering of material right here and um if even if i like pull it up more up my neck it still just falls back down so this isn't exactly you know the chic style i was imagining i wonder if i cover it up with like a necklace if it'll you know look i mean i could but i just i don't think this is serving looks like i wanted it to be it just i it's like Hey guys, I hate this fold so much. Otherwise, this shirt is really nice. I'm just being picky, but um, yeah, for the price I paid, I mean, I can't complain, but uh, I don't think I'm gonna keep it just cause it's just not sitting right on my body. Okay guys, so the next thing up is a little plaid skirt. I lowered the camera angle. Hopefully you guys will be able to see, you know, my bottom half a little better, but it is this gorgeous plaid skirt. It's got six buttons going down here. It kind of has like that double breasted jacket kind of feel to it. The buttons are gold in case you guys are wondering, and it has a side zipper over here. But yeah, overall, I really like it. The quality feels really good. It's a little thick, but not too thick that I'll be hot if I wore it in the spring. Cause right now it's not too hot, not too cold. So I could probably still get a bit of wear from it, but this will probably have to wait till the fall and winter to actually get some good wear. Okay, so next up I've got the other skirt from that same listing. This one is a tweed material. It's definitely different, but it has the same double breasted kind of button style here. The buttons on this one are gold as well, but this one is a tweed material with that plaid pattern and this one's obviously black and the other one was more gray black and white but um this one i kind of an issue with if you guys can see this is the two top buttons so i think they hemmed it kind of um crooked a little but i don't know if you guys can tell this is with the hem folded over one button's here one's here so yeah it's slightly slightly crooked but i mean i could fix that myself other than that the quality feels really good it's really thick so this one is more of a winter skirt, but um, I picked it up now, so for the price I paid, it's pretty good. Next skirt is this brown corduroy kind of skirt. I feel like all the skirts that I picked up are actually a little more fall, but I guess I just picked them up because, you know, I, I really like them. But um, I picked up a skirt actually similar to this in a previous Shein haul but it was a little lighter, more nude, and this is kind of more of what I was envisioning, but the other one had a garterized back on here, and you know, I don't really like picking up skirts and stuff with that kind of backing because eventually they do wear out faster than stuff without it, so I really like this. It is a A-line kind of skirt with this button detailing. They are real buttons, they go down. I like this one. It's a little thin, so if I wanted to wear it this spring, I could, but you know, I think I picked up enough stuff that I won't have to wear, you know, my fall-ish kind of items. But typically the way I wear my clothes, I don't wear them specifically for fall or winter or whatever. I wear them all year round. I wear anything that I want whenever I want and that's how it should be. So you don't necessarily have to follow any fashion rules or whatever because who cares? It's your body, you know what I'm saying? So this next skirt, I feel like I should have sized up to be honest. This is an extra small, but according to the like measurements on the website for this skirt, you know, this one should have been a little looser, but it is it is pretty skin tight. The only thing I have an issue with is the length. It literally cuts right here. I don't know if you guys can really see, but it cuts right under my butt cheek, like right under it. So this one I think I just can't keep because it's just, I love it. I like the plaid on it, but I can't just be walking around with my butt cheeks coming out. 
So, I mean, this one is really cute. The material feels great. It's like kind of thick. It feels like something you could pick up from Forever 21 or something like that. It feels really good and soft. It's just a shame that it's just a little too short. Next up, I've got this leather pencil skirt. And it's really cute. It has a slit right here, if you guys can see. I mean, it's really cute, right? But the thing is, it, it doesn't close. <laughs> So, I mean, like, according to the measurements, this should have fit fine, but it just doesn't close around my butt, let alone it looks like it's one of those skirts that give you those, that smash booty kind of thing where it, like, makes all your curves just disappear. I guess this is a blessing in disguise. I'm gonna cover it up because I feel my butt cheeks in the wind, you know, they're just out for display. So this one I definitely cannot keep. But the good thing is I have just picked up one from Topshop from my trunk club, which I got not too long ago. So that kind of fulfilled my like mini leather skirt kind of craving. But I was just, I was just shopping for another and I guess this one didn't work. It does feel good quality to be fair. It feels pretty thick and nice. It feels like pretty good. It's just like it doesn't fit. <laughs> so I put back on that see-through kind of long sleeve turtleneck so that I could put on the next couple dresses that honestly they're a little not so spring and summery but I picked them up because I really wanted them. So this is the first dress and honestly I picked this up because I saw the exact exact same dress at Forever 21 for pretty much more than double the price it was on Shein and I just thought it was ridiculous because I really liked it at Forever 21 and I was so excited I recognized it right away when I saw it on Shein's website so it fits really amazing it is a size extra small it's got this zip here and it goes all the way down and it fits perfectly. I don't know if you guys can tell where it ends on my body, but it ends just right at my fingertips. So it's perfect. I love that it's got that openness. Obviously, I probably wouldn't wear it with the see-through shirt because that kind of defeats the purpose of it being kind of modest. But I really, really like this. It feels great. It's got this cute plaid design on it, and I love it. I actually think I have another dress in my closet with the exact same pattern actually I think it's the same exact material fabric but um yeah it's really cute oh actually I think I actually picked up another one that has you guys I have a taste what can I say so this next one is similar but different this one has two button kind of detail here these two buttons open up and it kind of just whips open but um so you notice how there's just two sets of buttons um, this whole part right here is just completely open, you know? I, I don't know what that's all about because I feel like if you're just walking down the street, you know, things are gonna slip out. I don't- what? What is this? Oh my god. I mean, like, this takes the whole, like, I was going for a sexy librarian kind of feel, takes that sexy librarian to the next level because it's like hey guys <laughs> I just I don't know like I mean like it's cute like to be honest with the slits kind of cute but I feel like is it practical from here down it's just completely open and free to the world I mean like it's kind of cool because it has pockets but I don't know if the pockets save it from the coochie slipping out it's like this corduroy kind of material it's very thin feels very cheap to be honest this one I don't think I can keep just because I don't think practically I will get wear out of it just because of the way that the buttons lie. Like, I don't know from the picture I just didn't get this. This one is a little longer so it's a little more modest. It actually gets a lot longer. It, it goes a little above my knees which I actually really like because this is a good church dress. Like I could just wear a cardigan over and I could wear it to church. It's got this tie on the sleeves. So you can just tie those into bows. I didn't tie them though. And it's got this little string right here which isn't really attached to the dress. You can wear it with it or without it. And I really like it. I think it is very high quality. This one is one of the more pricier pieces from this haul. And I think you can definitely tell like... Also look at that. How cute is that detail right there? 
but um it feels really expensive and nice and they even gave me an extra button in here like I'm shook this is what the material looks like up close it's got these cute flowers and it's lavender y'all know I love lavender this next piece is a little romper I love it it is so stinking adorable so it is this cute like gray it's almost like a taupe color to be honest I don't know if you guys can tell kind of like a taupe on the website it looks a little more gray but I'm fine with this color honestly and it's just striped with white and it's really cute and girly and this is another one with that optional kind of tie right here you don't have to tie it if you don't want to it comes completely off but I really like how it has this ruffling on the bottom and it's like it's short but it's not too short so Keep in mind, I am five feet, so if you are way taller than me, it might be a little too short. But the uh, sleeves, well, straps are adjustable, so you could always make it like way longer if you'd like. But yeah, this is really cute. I like the little button detail. I think this this one is surprising me, to be honest. I thought this was gonna be a little cheaper and a lot more see-through, but it's not. It's actually, it might be double layered in here. Cause it's not even see-through at all I feel like next up I've got another a little romper to share with you guys as you can see like I said before I'm trying to mix it up with the colors in my closet a bit so this one is a bright red it's got these flowers on it let me show you guys detailing up close and this one I don't know I don't remember honestly if it was supposed to be off the shoulder or not but it looks like it could be either or so that's pretty cute it's roughly here so if you want to wear it up here, you can wear it like that, or you can wear it off the shoulders. So I think that's really cute. It's got a zipper on the back, so it is very nice and fitted. I really like this. The only thing that it's kind of missing is pockets, to be honest. So this next piece might be the piece that I was most excited about out of all of these clothes. And the funny part about this is that everyone I kind of showed it to all just didn't like it you know my parents just didn't like that it was a baby doll style I don't know I really love this dress you know y'all have seen this dress before right this is not a new style this dress I have seen this dress so many times previously in my life I've always been looking for the perfect one but the thing is the length was never right and so I saw the reviews on this dress and I almost peed myself because I saw that everyone was kind of complaining that it was a little short and I saw in the pictures how long it fell on people and me being five feet you know it's hard for me to find things that fit the way I would like them to fit in terms of length unless I ensure that it is a mini so this fits perfectly how I envisioned this dress to be my whole life and the thing is like a lot of people don't understand it because it just it's just like a loose like not really complementing the shape kind of dress but this is one of those dresses like you just need a close your eyes right now and picture yourself in this dress you have this chunky necklace on you got some cool gladiator sandals or cute flip-flops on you're walking by the beach at the resort and the Sun is starting to set you're with your significant other and it's just beautiful and it's just like the perfect you know holiday dress you know, this is the dress that you wear on holiday, going to a beachy place or a warm place, and you look super cute and you look like you you tried, but you really didn't because you're just comfy. And that's what I like about this. I love that it's just loose and comfortable. It's got this ruffle right here, and it, it just fits perfectly. It ends like right at my fingertips, a little under, and it is perfect where I want it to fall. So this next dress is another one that's right down my alley, if you guys know me. I love the plaid, I love the collars, and this one was just screaming my name for the longest time. It is this gorgeous plaid dress with this Peter Pan collar right here, and it is pretty mini. It fits like way under my arm's length but yeah it kind of fits perfectly for a short girl like me so I really like this I feel like I'm kind of giving you detective vibes I do enjoy a good plaid a good collar and it fits perfectly like a dream and this is the dress that I originally started my order with I was like okay let's do a Shein order because I need this dress in my life and this is one that I can definitely see myself wearing a lot like a lot this is right down my alley and I love it like 
I think that this might be my new favorite piece from this haul. I don't know. I feel like everything keeps being my favorite thing, but this one is definitely up there. This next dress is one of the pieces that I already, from the picture on the website, I kind of already knew from the get-go it was gonna be questionable material so this is what it looks like it has this cute like detached sleeve thing that's in style right now and it's roughly it's really cute I got it in the nude color there's also I think the other color was a bluish color and it's got this like slit right here well it's kind of like to the middle to the right for me I guess it depends if you want to move it more to the middle and the picture on the lady it was like in the middle but I don't really like it in the middle middle so I would prefer it with my leg kind of coming out so it falls kind of long on me but it doesn't touch the ground still I know you guys can't exactly see it but um sorry about that so it fits really nice I feel like the vision I had for this is that you know you could wear it to a wedding as a wedding guest or you could wear it to a nice like fancy garden party or something like that with some heels I think this would look really nice with heels on because of the slit it would be really sexy but you could still pull off a little classiness you know this next romper was I think the most expensive thing from this entire haul and rightfully so oh my god it is so high quality I don't know how to describe it to you guys like look at this up close this is what it looks like up close. I wish I could show you the bottom up close, but it is layered. It's got multiple layers and it's really nice. Oh, like what? This feels so expensive. I feel like I got it at like Macy's or something. I'm sorry about the sun getting brighter, but there we go. So it just, it fits so nicely. It was definitely worth the price. I think it was like 20 bucks or something like that. So I'm really happy about this. It has these three buttons here keeping the top half closed. So if you wanted to, you could wear a cami under or something because it does, it is kind of open here, but I don't mind it. And you could always wear a cute bralette under if you would like so that if it pops open a little, you know, it's fine. It also has this tie right here that cinches in the waist and it's so high quality. Look at this, it even has like these gold metallics on the ends. This might be my favorite Shein item of all time. And it is the perfect length for me. As you can see, it's a little short. So once again, if you're tall, keep that in mind. I'm five and a half, five and a half. This next outfit is a two piece set. It comes with this crop top and these shorts. These shorts are garterized on the back as well as the top. It's really cute. I like the top a lot. I could definitely match this up with different pieces like wear this top with a different bottom i definitely like this though i like the color let me come up close so you guys can see it better it is like this very genie blue kind of color and i really like it next two piece set is this right here it comes with this crop top and these shorts this one has a little tie here i mean honestly i don't really need it it's just for design because it is garterized so it's fitting pretty nicely it's kind of short but I like it it's a good length for me and this crop top is honestly kind of the reason why I bought this two-piece set to be honest it's really cute I don't know if you guys can see the Sun is kind of washing it out but it is just kind of like a cropped cami here with attached little sleeves and it is really simple but really nice and it's very nice quality it's very thick and it feels good it's kind of sucking me in a little and I like it but um, I like the top a lot I feel like I could wear this with a ton of different options on my bottom and I like the shorts they are kind of thin but not super thin that they feel cheap and will be completely see-through I'm pretty sure they're not see-through at all yeah they're not see-through at all so I really like that so we are down to the last outfit as you can see it's a little two-piece set it comes with these shorts they're red with some white hearts on it they've got a little ruffle flaps on the front and along the bottom it comes up a little on the sides and the top is so adorable it's got like this exaggerated puff sleeve on the shoulder and then it's got that sweetheart neckline just like that black shirt did and it goes up to my elbows I really love this outfit oh my god I know it's not gonna be everyone's cup of tea because it's kind of in your face with the hearts but I love it and typically I wouldn't really like this color like it's like this red color I mean 
it, on camera it looks a lot brighter but actually in person it's a little darker of a red which thank god because I was really nervous it was gonna be super bright red and in your face and I would only be like able to wear it for Valentine's Day or something like that but you know you can't really wear this on Valentine's Day too because it's cold but anyways I really really like this I wanted to try out something in a red and I like it a lot I'm really surprised that I like it and you know honestly this whole outfit is really with the short hair and all that stuff it's really giving me like 1950s pinup rockabilly kind of vibes and oh I love that I love that so that is it for my little well I say little but it was actually a pretty big haul my little Shein spring summer whatever you want to call it closet update kind of haul. I'm really happy with the majority of the things that I actually found. I gotta be honest with you guys. I mean, typically it's usually like 75% really great stuff, then 25% I it's kind of duds. But to be honest, I only had like a couple pieces that were kind of duds for me. And I'm really happy with all of the items that I found today. Like I said previously in the video, if you guys are interested in anything that I picked up, Today I will try to find them and include the links in the description box below so you can find out all the info that you need down there and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!